Like Hi guys, for, like, we are here scared. at Frightmares, ready to get scared. Yes. Fire. Are you ready to get scared? No. I don't want to go to the house place. Is it spooky here? Parker, are you ready to go to some haunted houses? No. Well, tonight's going to be awesome. That goes to spooky. Now that's the scariest thing I've seen all night. We are getting ready to go to the Spookaboo, our first Frightmares haunted house. Are you ready? Ready or not, here we come. They're dancing like Egyptians. Vampire layer. Do you guys know what animal a vampire changes into? Very good. You guys think one candy. Best dance. Yeah. Oh, you guys are so good. There was this one girl and she was doing that and she just like said, That was so good. Thank you. You're welcome. Maybe it's because she didn't get any candy. You gotta leave that city alone. She was gonna tear it down. All right guys, so we made it through the Spookaboo, but word is that there is a haunted corn maze somewhere here. I don't know if I dare. I dare, I want candy. The wall of pumpkins? Dun, dun, dun. Let's that I don't feel so good about this, guys. It's time for Treat Street. Whatever oh, that is. I know it's a street with treats. That's my kind of street. These things are fun and all, but there's tons of people here, so waiting in line is not that fun. More candy for me. Take a picture with you guys' feet. Great way to try. I'm on me. Awesome, I'm on me. How about you guys? You can do it. Look, it's kind of like a ninja. Okay. It's karate. Yeah. Good job. Here you want this? Awesome. Here, what color do you want? That one. Steven thinks he's cool. Guys, I just found some criminals. And I'm the one that caught him. Super fun straw maze. Hi guys. Oh my goodness guys, it's so foggy. <laughs> I can't please. It's true true, right? Okay, you guys go get grab some out of the bucket. Good job you guys. I'm impressed. Alright girls, you wanna take another picture? Yeah. Ready, one, two, three. We did it, Bailey. Who dares to go on a really scary haunted house? Me! Not me. What about you, Blake? <gasps> so that means one of us has to go in. You guys ready for this? No! I think Jordan changed her mind. Oh well. Dad, I'm scared. Can I hold your hand? Mm -hmm. I'm Daddy's You're going to let in alone. Like we are in some kind of haunted 
This thing is creepy. I kind of want to ride one. I wonder what they did. I think I lost the kids forever. Not today, Jack. I am not going in there. There's ghosts up there. our dinner here at Frightmares and it is so late. We just had so much fun. We're going to all the haunted houses, but now we are going to relax for a little bit and feel our bellies. Hey, what'd you get? Pizza. Taylor, what'd you get? Pizza. Steven, what'd you get? Pizza and burrito. 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 I got pizza and Jordan. I got pizza and burrito. Blake got a bottle. Which is totally normal for Parker. All right guys, so Frightmares is almost over. It's almost time to close. But before we leave, we are going to let Steven and Taylor play a little carnival game. Cause we're awesome at it. I'm gonna win this thing. Oh, come on. One. Two. I won! My turn. <laughs> Dang it, I lost. Alright, here's your guys. Hey, Parker, what you mom, mom, mom. mom, look what I won from the game. Um, that thing is really creepy looking. Yeah, I kind of don't want it. All right guys, so we had a blast. Now it's time to head home and end this vlog. All right guys, we have made it home. All of the kids are asleep in the car. It is late, but I think it was a pretty effective day. Jamie? What? Jamie? What? What's that? Um, it's a day after we went to Lagoon and Taylor won that crazy doll and she left it at Lagoon, but then it followed us to our garage. Um, we kind of really don't know what's going on. We have the doll right here, but when we picked her up out of the garage yesterday, we found a note attached to her. It's right here, guys. And what does it have on it? A C. It has a C on it. Maybe it spells something? Maybe you guys should back up just a little bit. I really don't know where that doll came from, and it tends to move around. This is totally creeping me out. Maybe for now we just shouldn't touch the doll, okay? Guys, it just moved. Like, what? It, it hand was down, and now it's like that. All right, we're just gonna be cautious and stay away from the doll for a second. Both Steve and Steven are in the house, so we're a little nervous. It's just us and the girls, and we're gonna try and figure out what this letter means. We're gonna open it up and hopefully just stay away from the doll until Steve and Steven can come back. <laughs> we're getting ready to open up the letter, guys. Is it a card inside? Yeah, it's a cord. Yeah, it's a cord. Whoa. Whoa. It's cursive. All right, okay, Taylor, read it really loud so everyone can hear. Okay. Are you ready for this? Dear Salty family, this one is to us. I'm just going to read it. Mom. Salty family, you have been specially chosen to care for my precious Cynthia. Cynthia? Guys, that's why I had a seal and don't know. Her name's Cynthia, maybe. 
She is one of my youngest dolls that I have sent away for special purposes. What special purposes? And the note says one of the dolls. Does that mean that there are more dolls? Yes. Yeah. How many dolls are there? Maybe the person that sent us that note makes dolls or something. Guys, hmm. look at the end of the note. It says the doll maker. That's who it's from. Guys! You were right. It's a doll maker. All right, guys, well, before we get ahead of ourselves, we're gonna finish reading this note and then we're gonna try and decide what to do with this doll. Welcome her into your home and be sure to treat her as one of your family members. We have to treat her as one of our family members? No, no, we are not feeding her cereal. We're not making her lunch. We're not putting her to sleep. We're not doing anything. We're not letting her go to school. She is generally well behaved as long as she is receiving constant attention. Be sure to keep an eye on her at all times. She has a mind of her own and must be cared for. Remember, she is very dear to me, the doll maker. Guys, guys, the doll just moved. <gasps> guys, the doll's not here. All right, so this letter is really frightening and kind of weird, and the doll is gone, which is even scarier right now, so we are gonna go look everywhere for this doll. Guys, let's stick together, okay? Come on. All right, guys, we're gonna check the scariest parts of our house first. We're gonna check the garage, and then the basement. Okay. Okay, Peyton, open the garage till we can see her. Just look inside real quick, okay? Anywhere? No doll. There's, There's no doll. doll. Okay, come back in. Because, come back in. But the, the garage is open. All right, guys. Taylor is brave enough to check the basement for us. Okay, go ahead. I'm ready. So things just don't seem to be adding up. It's so weird that the doll was following us around Lagoon and then Taylor won it. It's like it's supposed to be here. And then we get that note where we've been chosen. It has a letter C on it, which we know now stands for Cynthia. But now the doll is going from bedroom to bedroom to bedroom in each other's beds. What does that mean? Guys, she's getting so sweet. I'm having a hard time believing that she's bad. Maybe she's trying to tell us something then. If she's trying to tell us something, then what is it that she's trying to say? I don't get it. Maybe she's trying to tell us something that she's tired. Maybe it's tricky. Maybe like a letter thing. Well, C stands for Cynthia, so B stands for bed. All right, so Taylor makes a good point, but we need to keep everything straight in our minds, so go get a notepad, and then we'll kind of write down everything that we're trying to figure out. All right, let's do this. All right, B for bed. I don't know if the idea of Cynthia giving us a message or not makes me feel better, but she's gone again, guys! Seriously, she's gone. Okay, we need to find her so that we can get the next part to the message. Okay, girls, everyone search. This way. This look in there. You guys look in your room again. Where the Mom, plan? the dog! Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, what does this mean? She's pointing at a flashlight. Maybe she's scared of the dog like me. See. 
Okay, she is at the flashlight. She's at a light. It could be an F or an L, maybe. She's definitely pointing to the light. Or is it a plug? Outlet, electricity. E would work. C, B, C, B, E. There's a lot of words that can be um, start with B, E, and we definitely need a vowel. Let's just do E for electricity. Sounds good to me. I hope we're doing this right. Well, what do we do now? She's not moving. Maybe we need to give her some space. All right, everyone, let's go into the playroom real quick, and then we'll just kind of leave Cynthia, it's so weird to call her by a name, Cynthia here, and then we'll see if she moves and gives us more clues, if we're even doing this right. Let's watch. All right, guys, so we are in the playroom, and we hooked up our baby monitor into Steven's room where the doll is right now, so as you can see, there's the camera showing the doll right now, and we're gonna just watch it, and we're gonna see if the doll moves at all. How are you doing, guys? Good. good. Okay. You getting a little scared, or are you guys okay? Well, okay. Did you just see that? Yeah, it disappeared. Guys, do you hear that? Hear what? Oh, there. You are. Guys, come on. Come on. I don't hear anything. What is it? Open it. I do hear it. I do hear it. Do you guys hear that? Get a baby! Come on, Blake! The water. What is that? What? The water's on! The water's on? But where's Cynthia? Guys, I still hear water and it's coming from my room. Come on. Like a lot of water. Hope it's not flooding. This is weird. Oh my goodness, all of the faucets are on. Turn them off. The shower's on, guys! Oh my gosh, Mom! In the tub! Okay, turn everything off, guys. Okay, do you guys hear anything? I still feel like I hear water. The kitchen! Come on, guys, go, go. Guys? Is it there? What about W? All right, so for sure that sounds for W, water. That was pretty obvious. So far we have C for Cynthia, B for bed, E for electricity, and W for water. Sabu. Boo! Boo! It doesn't make sense right now. Something bad's happened. Yeah. What? Okay, the doll from Lagoon. Yeah. She is here, you know? What? She's what? giving us letters. She's moving around the house. These are the things we what got. About oh, so Wait, what are you talking about? Come here, I'll show you where the Cynthia is. She's in the kitchen. We got a letter attached to Cynthia, yeah. and she was made by the doll maker, and he named her, and he says that she's going to be here, and she has a special purpose, and apparently the doll maker has made other dolls that are somewhere else. That's pretty creepy, guys. Come here, guys, I'll show you where she is. Right here. Um. Are you guys hallucinating? There's nothing there. Where did she go? She moved again! She keeps moving places. All right, so Steven and Uncle Derek, we're gonna need your guys' help to look around the house to try and see if you guys can find Cynthia so we can get the next clue to her message. Not in the laundry room. I've searched everywhere upstairs and I haven't seen her yet. You're eating food! Sometimes you gotta eat during spooky things. I don't see her in the living room. She's not in the living room! She's not in here right now. You guys need to come here! Go. What? 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 <gasps> Here? Oh my gosh! What in the world is she guys, doing? Guys, look up there! She's 
pointing at something? Oh! That was not like that. I didn't even know that was up there. Um, that's the attic, guys. Hey, attic! That's our clue! Hey! Write it down. Wait, hey! Your doll is creepy, okay? I have to be honest, this doll stuff is really weird. Weird for you. We've been like experiencing all the creepy stuff. We're just waiting in the living room, um, letting Cynthia, I guess, move. It's so weird to say that, but we don't want to be around her when all of a sudden she disappears. So we're waiting here, and then in a minute, I'm going to send somebody to go check on Cynthia. Bobby! Bobby! All right, Jordan. You're the lucky one. I think we've given the doll enough time to move. Will you go check and see? No. Is she still in the closet? No. Oh, yeah, you're super lucky. Fine, I'll be brave. I'll go check. She's not gone. She's not gone. Is there anything different? Yeah, there's this pink strings. Really? Yeah, go! Guys, she was probably trying to climb up there. What is that? The thing shot string. String? Yeah. You know what that is, guys? <gasps> it shut. Is that a string she's holding? I think she shut it. You know what it. that is, guys? No, yeah. what That's is it? That's ribbon. Ribbon? Oh, it's ribbon. Oh, she's a piece of Wait, own that. Mommy, here's a piece of Do you think glass. we should write R for ribbon? Yeah. Would it make sense? Yeah. Like, what's all the numbers yeah. all about and letters all about? We think she's sending us a secret message. Like Morse code or something? No, like we think everything that she gives us hints and clues to is the beginning of a word. Beginning of a word. So R for ribbon. So what do we have? We have C B E W A R. What's that spell? What? Maybe we spell. move the letters around to do, try to make a word. Like it's scrambled? Yeah, like a scrambled puzzle. Yes! What? Jordan! What? Cynthia's gone! What? Just the ribbons left. What? Guys? Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh. How did that happen? Like right before our eyes, we were just looking at the notebook. Guys, it is getting late. We need to find Cynthia and solve this puzzle because I am getting so tired. So everybody, let's find Cynthia again and see what kind of clue we get, okay? Are you up for it? Yeah, yes. let's go. Okay. You girls go in there. Taylor, you go upstairs, okay? With Uncle Derek. You go in here. What? Do you see Not her? Here. She really here. Guys, Steven Banner, she's in the piano room. What is it? Um, what is it? Outlet? Plug? Plug. Charger? Plug. Charger? She needs to be charged. Uncle Derek, can you help us figure this out? We're just trying to decide if um, we do an E again, because she's pointing out the outlet, so it could be E. And we're trying to see what this thing means. All right, so do you think you can see any kind of word in there? Beware. What? Wait, what comes after the R and beware? E. Oh, shoot. She's pointing <clears throat> to electricity, guys. So if you write E for beware, what? It says Cynthia beware. B-E-W-A-R-E. So it's Cynthia, and then, and then we got B. Where? What does it mean? Beware of Cynthia. She's not a good doll at all. Okay, guys. You know what? We don't need Cynthia in our house. This is not good. I don't know if that's what the clues meant, but it's we're getting rid of her. I'm gonna get rid of her. I'm gonna get her far, far away, guys. I got rid of the doll. Good. I've been doing some research. 
You gotta take a look at this. I've been searching for hours, and this is what I came up with. This doll is creepy, and this doll maker is even creepier? You just typed that! It's true though. But, I did find this. What is that? <gasps> That's Cynthia! The Doll Maker 101? That's someone's Instagram. Guys, there are three other dolls besides Cynthia. Guys, we need your help. We need you to try and figure out who the doll maker is, who set up this Instagram, and who has these other dolls. Creepy. Your doll is creepy, okay? Guys, I found this doll out on the front porch. I think it got left out all night. It is time to get rid of Cynthia for good. We have decided that we are going back to Lagoon, the amusement park where Taylor won her to begin with, and we are going to return her back to the person that gave her to us because we don't want her anymore. Here. I'm worried that Uncle Derek is going to be too scared. <laughs> Guys, it's so crowded. That's the scary part about this place is that when it closes, we're going to be stuck in the parking lot forever. I got to leave. Is that your new wife? Date night. Steve just said that it's his old wife. Yuck, yuck, yuck. We just survived our first haunted house and we got tons of candy. The girls wanted to take a break from haunted houses and ride a ride, so there they are going around in circles over and over again. I'm so excited. We are watching a pretty intense show, it's pretty crazy. We came to Lagoon, we dropped off Cynthia, we rode some rides, we went to some haunted houses, we watched a show, we ate some dinner. But these kids are freezing cold and it is time to go home. I need to get warmed up. <laughs> loaded in the car and ready to head home. All right guys, we are home. All of the kids are in bed. I can barely move because I am so exhausted. We are gonna call it a night and we will see you guys in the morning.
guys, it's morning. Um, we kind of had a restless sleep. Um, we woke up this morning and things just kind of didn't feel right. Uh, it felt a little weird. So we decided that we are going to get out of the house and go for a drive. We are going to head to look um, at some pretty fall leaves up in the mountains. Guys, are you ready to go? Yeah. yeah. Hey guys, so we got to see some really pretty beautiful leaves up in the mountains. We drove around for a bit. It was a little too cold to get out up there. So we decided to stop at this really cool looking church. We're gonna walk around it. It's super old and let the kids stretch their legs before we head on home. Did you like looking at all of the beautiful fall leaves? I did. Look at how old this church is. <laughs> Look at guys. All of the windows, they're just so old, it's so beautiful. <laughs> there are some really pretty stairs leading up to some doorways at the front of this church. So we're gonna take a really quick family picture before we freeze to death. guys so we got our picture the kids stretched their legs a little bit but we are heading to the car I can't stand being out here for longer than like two seconds Why? it is freezing I really don't like the cold weather it's not freezing I feel awesome all right we're home it's time to eat some dinner and get some baths and go to bed But we keep trying to get rid of Cynthia and she keeps coming back. It looks like she may be stuck with our family forever. I don't know what to do. Mom, I feel like the door maker somehow controlling her. Like there's like a camera somewhere? Camera is there? I think you're right guys. I mean, there's gotta be a camera or something. I mean, just look at this. On the doll maker's Instagram account, there's a picture of me. Oh my goodness, Steven. Right here. Guys, that's a picture of Cynthia and Steven. His post says, good Cynthia, make them feel like you are one of them and part of their family. They won't suspect a thing. Um, I'm pretty sure I suspect a thing. All right guys, so we are taking a different strategy. We have decided that instead of trying to get rid of the doll, and putting the doll different places, we are going to keep the doll around us at all times so that maybe we can try and get an idea of who the doll maker is. We know that the doll is recording or at least taking pictures of what we're doing, so we are gonna be very careful what we say and do around the doll. I have a really bad feeling about this doll. All right, so we are going to spend all night doing research on the doll maker. Steven, Steve, go get a computer. I'm gonna go put the girls to bed. They're a little nervous. Good night, girls, okay? We're gonna try and figure out who the doll maker is, okay? Okay. We'll just try and get some rest, all right? Good luck. See you in the morning, Mom. All right, the girls are in bed. We're gonna see if we can figure anything out about this doll. I'm gonna leave her in the kitchen. She creeps me out. So from his Instagram account, we know that there's only four dolls that he's created. There's a doll for four channels. Us, Smelly Belly, that YouTube family. And the Scories. Why do you think he chose those four channels? Do we have something in common? 
And we are obviously not the only ones being watched, guys. These pictures are taken of these other channels from the doll's point of view. So one thing that I have noticed when I have talked to some of these other channels and have watched some of their videos is that their dolls are tending to gravitate towards one family member. And we have kind of noticed that with Taylor. I'm a little nervous. I'm mainly thinking that might be the case because Taylor won the doll at the carnival. When we played the carnival game, I did better than her. And I only got this small Hulk stuffed animal and she got a doll. That's true, I've never seen anything like one of those dolls at a carnival. Yeah, like, name one time. The main giveaway that something is up was that letter from the doll maker. It kind of explained everything that we needed to take care of Cynthia and that she's going to become a member of our family and I am worried that she's going to gravitate towards Taylor. What does it mean to become a member of our family? Well, on this website, I found this thing. It's, it's like a legend or a tale of the doll maker. And I think it's supposed to be like an old story, but it says in this story specifically that the dolls that the doll maker makes try to take over somebody in your family. Wait, where's Cynthia right now? So we have decided that we are going to have Cynthia become an official member of our family. Cynthia Yeager? No. Cynthia Yeager. And what better way to include someone in our family than to play hide and seek with them? We figure that if we make her a member of our family, maybe we can find out more stuff about the doll maker. We need to know his secrets. He's watching you. Okay, Cynthia, the game we're gonna play is a hide and seek game, kind of like starting. You're gonna hide first. We're gonna go looking for you, and the last person to find you loses. Are you ready to play your first game with us, Cynthia? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Mom's back here. Cynthia! 
Yeah, I knew you were in here. Why are you so wet? so nice to me. Why does no one else ever get to see you move, Cynthia? Cynthia, this is a good hiding spot. Five. We're gonna be best friends. Wait, where's Taylor? She said she loves us. See, she just moved. No. 
Evelyn, look away. Okay. Guys, she just moved. No, she didn't. Nothing happened. Yeah, Taylor, when we're not looking, she moves. You guys gotta believe me. Dolls don't move, Taylor. Guys, we have to be quieter. Parker's coming. I wonder where Parker's at. Cynthia, where do you think she's at? Stop talking to her. She's she safe. She's a doll. She's my friend. She's not real. Why would you take her back? She gave me a high five. No, she moved and get to a high five. Mm -mm. I mean, like that by Me too. Come on, Cynthia. I won this game. Isn't that right, Cynthia? Now it's time for us to hide and Cynthia to find us. Yeah. Alright, Cynthia, no peeking. Let's family so I guess we are on a road trip on a hunt for the doll maker Stanley, are you being careful with Cynthia yes she's fine okay good the dog maker The doll Cynthia told Taylor where we could kind of find the doll maker, I guess. And Taylor told us that she said somewhere south. So we jumped in the car and we headed south. Really far south. Guys, look at the beautiful view we have. Look at that too. It's amazing. Look at that steam inside. Taylor has kind of helped direct us to this beautiful landscape that we are now and she's going to let us know when we need to get out of the car and start looking. Maybe we will find the doll maker today. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? It's a, it's a bad thing. Unfortunately, we really don't know if the doll maker is good or bad or if Cynthia is really trying to help us or if she's leading us to the doll maker because she's not on our side. Dun dun dun! Guys! Stop! We're here! We're here? This is where Cynthia wants us to stop! Cynthia, what did you say? Cynthia says she's been here with the doll maker before. She's too scared to go out there again. She wants to stay in the car. Alright. Okay. Alright, so there, you stay here. We're gonna go collect some clues. 
Yep. All right, guys, so we really don't know what we're looking for, but we know that the doll maker has been here at one point. So we're going to on the lookout for some clues. If you guys notice anything, comment below. If I was a doll maker and I had a secret shop, I'd put it in a cave. There's lots of caves out there. Get a Parker found a path. This place is so big and there's so many things to see. I don't know if we're gonna find any clues. I don't know what Cynthia wants us to know. Maybe she just wanted us to go on a vacation. Should we go for this creepy path behind me? Or the safe one? The safe one. We agree with Parker. Guys, it's a double arch. There's also this giant caves here. It looks just like a painting. I've read about these double arches before. Maybe that's why Cynthia wanted to come here. I wonder why she would want us to come to these double arches. What could that mean? Or why the doll maker cared so much about the double arches. Parker, did you plant a little tree on the walkway? Uh, what are you doing? Do you what? Are you doing? what? All right, guys, we reached it to the very, very top. And then it's just a drop. Just We didn't see the doll maker, but we saw an amazing view. Guys, it is so beautiful and amazing up here. All the kids are having an awesome time. We have Steven and Taylor. We have Parker, we have Mommy, and then Jordan is hiding behind a rock up there. Guys, where's Peyton and Dad? We don't know where Peyton, Dad, and Blake are. What, they are missing? Guys, there's cave here, let me check if they're in here. Are they in there? No. Do you see them? Oh, there's another cave, maybe then here. Do you see them in there, guys? Oh, that goes down goes forever. The... Guys, they're not down here anywhere. Maybe we should go back and see if they're over there. We were having so much fun taking pictures and looking at the scenery that I don't know when they went missing at all. Maybe the doll maker caught them. All right, guys, we have left the trail in search for Dad and Peyton and Blake, and it is getting dark, getting a little nervous. Guys, do you see any sign of Dad and Peyton and Blake anywhere? Maybe we need to go back to the car where Cynthia is. Yes, for sure. She went away where the doll maker took them. All right, guys, we're leaving the double arches on a hunt for the rest of our family. It's starting to get a little cold and the sun's going down, so I'm worried because if we don't find them in enough time, I don't know what we're going to do. I'm not leaving here without them. All right guys, we are starting to get a little bit closer to the cars. There's just so many rocks and so much landscape out here. I don't know if we're gonna find them. And guys, go! Dad! 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 Oh my gosh! We found Dad and Peyton. They're in the middle of this weird circular rock structure. What are you doing, Peyton? This is Abigail, the dog, and Cynthia. What? She started hearing giggling and she came into this circle and started drawing. It was really weird. Guys, Cynthia has told me about Abigail. There's a drawing on the ground of two dolls and a C and an A. Abigail? Who's Abigail? I've heard of Cynthia, but Abigail? It was really, really weird. It was like she just saw something or heard something and then decided to draw. I've never seen her be like that before. It's time to go. Guys, we are walking back to the car and Parker is telling everyone that we pass, be careful guys. Be careful guys. Don't step on 
That's cute. You need to be careful. All right, guys, we are back in the car with Cynthia. Taylor felt um, when we were out there that we needed to come back to the car. Taylor, where should we be heading now? We should, uh, I think we should keep heading south. Okay, we're gonna keep heading south then. Stop, turn right now. Taylor, but this is a Denny's. Yeah, I know, I was hungry. I guess Taylor's stomach has spoken. We are eating dinner. We'll be back, Cynthia. These chicken nuggets are calling my name. crazy in the back. I don't know if we are going to be able to find anything else about the doll maker. What do you think tonight? I think we have to call it a night. I don't think there's anything else to learn today. Taylor, where should we go now? To Vogue What? <laughs> I know what Cynthia wants to do, but I want to go to bed. No. I'm so glad you said that, Taylor, because I am exhausted. Raise your hand if you want to go to bed. Woo! Good time. Guess we got to find a place to stay for the night. We found a place to stay. Well, I guess this is where we're staying for the night. Isn't that light, Cynthia? I'm so tired. Can we please just go to bed? Guys, I actually think we should talk a little bit about why we're here in the first place. Blake, why are we here? I don't know. <laughs> we know Cynthia sent us here. And there's a lot of cool things to look at here. We think Cynthia sent us to the double arches. I heard some crazy things while I was there. And she acts crazy too. Have you guys figured anything else out that we haven't seen yet? I'm not putting the clues together to understand why we were sent here or who the doll maker is at all. Cynthia, are you trying to help us? Abigail. What? Did she say Abigail? <laughs> yeah. What did she say? She said Abigail. Abigail? She only knows like five words and she said Abigail. Why would you say Abigail? <laughs> Abigail! Abigail is the name of the girl that Peyton drew. She drew a picture of Cynthia and then Abigail. How did you know that, Blake? Alright guys, things are getting a little weird. Blake does not speak yet and she said Abigail and then that whole weird thing with Peyton, um, Earlier today during our hike, things just kind of are getting a little creepy. Apparently the name Abigail is important. Wait guys, do you remember? The doll maker's Instagram shows all four dolls. Abigail is one of them. Guys, I'm gonna pull it up right now and show you. Guys, you have to see this. Someone was following us today. And it wasn't Cynthia. You need to check out the doll maker's Instagram account, the doll maker 101. Check out his pictures and see if you can find out who's following us. Taylor? Taylor. So we just got in the car. Taylor just randomly left the condo that we were staying in, acting all weird with Cynthia. So we jumped in the car and she said that we needed to keep heading further south. I guess it has something to do with the doll maker. It looks like we're going to be driving all night. Just keep heading south, guys. All right, so we have everyone in our family in the car. Um, Taylor, you have Cynthia, right? Yep. No, she's gone. Cynthia was by me, but now she's gone. Oh, uh, that's weird. She what? was here the entire time. How does that happen? I don't know. Where's Cynthia? Everyone look around. Do you see Cynthia? Oh, no. no. Guys, Cynthia's gone. We have to find her. Guys.
Guys, I just pulled up the doll maker's Instagram and I saw this post. Yeah, Abigail and Cynthia. Forever. It's a picture of Cynthia and Abigail somewhere where there's red rocks. Guys, we need to head south. Oh no, we have to drive. We need to find Abigail and Cynthia. All right guys, we have finally arrived at the place that the Instagram post led us to from the doll maker. And it is absolutely beautiful. There's tons of awesome hills and landscape, but that's gonna make it really, really hard. I have no idea how we are going to find our doll. Maybe we should just leave her here. I mean, she seems happy. We cannot leave Cynthia. Follow me, I'm gonna find her. No, not down there. I'm falling. Ah. Hey, and go look over there. See if you see Cynthia over there. I don't see her over here, guys. All right, guys, so we are looking for any clues that we can find related to the doll maker and if we can see any good hiding places because my bet is that Cynthia is somewhere hiding and She's with another doll. Uh, I hope we don't get lost in here, guys. We gonna get lost? Oh my. Well, at least she has Cheetos. I know Cynthia has to be around here somewhere. Her hiding spot. This would be a perfect hiding spot. I know Cynthia's right here. We had to go to the south. Fine. <laughs> Cynthia's not up there. Let's try and get at the top of this hill, guys, and see if we can get a good view of what we're working with. On top of this hill! Holy smokes. We need to head that way. Let's go. I don't. But without her, we're not gonna be able to figure out who the doll maker is. Guys, where are you? Found a tunnel. A tunnel? It's like a tight squeeze. Like Let me see. Is Cynthia. it somewhere where a doll could hide? Kind of. But Cynthia's not in there. Oh my goodness, guys. Some of these places are steep. These kinds of rocks go on forever, guys. I don't know if we're gonna find her. Look at how far it goes. I know we're gonna find her, guys. I just know it. I do it over here. Be careful, Parker. Oh, I'm stuck. I can't go any further. Do it like this. Parker, I'll go around, okay? Okay, I found another good place. <laughs> oh my goodness, look at right in there. Do you see anything? Goes. No, Cynthia's not in there. Darn it. We need to go south. We must go south. Taylor? We need to go south. 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 We need to find Cynthia quick because Taylor is acting weirder and weirder. What was it, Jordan? I don't know. I think something's following us. Okay, come on, Jordan. We need to find Taylor. She's already left us. She's just walking straight. Things are, some weird things are happening. Let's keep going, guys. So, we need to Taylor, go south. Taylor, knock out of it. Stop. Taylor, stop. Knock out of it. Taylor's acting weird one weird and now that Cynthia's gone. We are getting closer and closer to these crazy mountains over here that are super tall. And my guess is that if you were a doll, hiding, you would go there. 
Or if you're a crazy doll maker, you'd have a shop there. Are you really sure what you should be doing this, guys? Steven, do you see anything up there? No. Jordan, be careful. No. No dolls? No. I'm worried that if we don't find Cynthia, we may never get Taylor back to her normal self. Taylor, wait up! Taylor! Taylor! Stop, Taylor, slow down! Oh, guys, I feel like we're getting closer and closer to Cynthia. Guys, is that like a finger pointing somewhere? It must be a sign, guys, let's go. Guys, it looks like there's kind of a cliff thing over here. Let's get to the edge and see if what we can see. Are you kidding me? We have to climb over it? I don't think there's any way that we are going to be able to climb over that, especially with Parker. Secret passageway, of course. If I was a doll maker, I'd have a secret passageway. Guys, here's the passageway around the mountain. It's like a special little opening to get around the mountain. It's crazy. <gasps> Cynthia is over there. You mean that big, white, crazy mountain? Yep. To the left? That's what I mean. Whoa. Taylor, do you mean that mountain right there? Who wants to swim with me, guys? Whoa. Whoa! Whoa! We're trying to find the doll, Pan. Oh. All right, guys. I think in a minute we need to go climb up to that mountain and see if we can find Cynthia. I see Cynthia! Really? Yeah. That's not Cynthia, guys. It's what? <gasps> Who is that? Is here too. Guys, what are you doing here? We don't know. We're trying to find our doll and Jordan. Oh, doll's missing too. All right, guys, so we just found that YouTube family, and apparently their doll has disappeared too. So now we are on the search for two of our dolls. We saw the picture on Instagram, and so now we're hoping that it's around here. Taylor led us here, so is Cynthia anywhere around here? Yep, somewhere over here. All right, so we've reached the mountain that Taylor told us to go, but I don't see the dolls anywhere. Me neither. Why so high? Why can't the dolls be on the first floor? It's not happening. Taylor found Cynthia and Abigail. They went to Abigail and Cynthia. They're creepy back. So why do you think the dolls brought us here? I think it has something to do with two. It's Number two. It's like the second born, two dolls. Oh. They sent us to the double arches. Oh wow. Well, two That's people got lost. Yeah. I just don't know why the doll maker would bring us here. Do you think the doll maker has a secret hideout here? Well, maybe this is where the doll maker makes the dolls. I don't know. I'm thinking maybe 
it has nothing to do with the doll maker. Maybe the dolls just wanted to get together. Oh yeah. Play date. That may be it. Play date, yeah. Maybe they're like sisters or twins or friends. I don't know. There's got to be a reason we're all out here. Wait, where are they at? Wait, what? where did they go? Where Where's the dolls? Shit, they are never gonna go. Hi, Sudi family. So we are back from vacation. We had kind of fun, but. A lot of weird things happened while we were gone. Cynthia disappeared, Taylor was acting really weird, we went on a hunt for the doll maker, and then we found her with Abigail, that YouTube family's doll, and then when we found them, finally, after searching forever and ever, they just vanished right before our eyes. Things are just a little weird, it's been a little different not having Cynthia around, but I am getting ready to unpack all of my luggage, that's the worst part about going on vacation, is all of the unpacking. Ugh. I sent the girls upstairs to unpack their luggage, but my guess is that they are up there watching the iPad and not doing what I asked them to do. All right guys, before I venture into their room, I hear a baby that may have just woken up from her nap. Oh no, Blakers! You're not happy? You never know what side of the bed you're going to wake up on. Sometimes it's the wrong one, sometimes it's the right one. <laughs> Alright guys, here's the moment of the truth. Are they putting away their luggage or not? Why did you break our boots? It wasn't me. It was a freak storm. Guys! You were supposed to be putting away your luggage. Not watching a show. Come on guys. <laughs> Please put things away. <laughs> Cynthia? What? Cynthia, Cynthia. What? That's just not why. Where did Abigail go then? You came back to me, Cynthia. Cynthia totally followed us home from our vacation in Taylor's luggage. I told you guys you should have left Cynthia there. She disappeared. We have him. We should have looked harder for her. I mean, I was kind of relieved when she vanished. <laughs> Were you relieved too, Blakers? Cynthia, we're sorry. We didn't mean to leave you there. Cynthia, I'm so sorry. Can you forgive us? We didn't mean to leave you. I'm so glad you found us. Blake, are you kind of freaked out by this too? I'm freaked out. Guys, we didn't make it up to Cynthia. Cynthia, do you want to control our day? There's nothing weird about that at all, having a doll control our day. Hey, Cynthia, do you wanna to come to gymnastics with us? Guys, Cynthia's gonna to come to gymnastics with us. She said so. So the kids are eating real quick, and I guess they're gonna be going to gymnastics with Cynthia? Cynthia's in charge, Mom. Of course she is. All right, Cynthia, I'm done eating. Time to go to tumbling. She's lost her mind. Parker is not in gymnastics like the rest of the girls, but while she's at home and they're gone, she does gymnastics at home on the couch. Woo! I do front flips. Front flips? <laughs> that's, that's me. Holy moly. Mommy does not do front flips. Or in Parker's words, front flips. Front flips, says or not. Do you do front flips? I do. Okay. You guys, it is crazy how quiet a house can get when the majority of your kids are gone. <laughs> Steven is gone filming a video for his channel and the girls are at gymnastics and it is pretty quiet in here. I could get used to this. <coughs> Never mind.
All right guys, so I have made some progress on unpacking my luggage, but I need to take a break from that because the girls are done with gymnastics and it's time for me to go pick them up and I guess I get to pick Cynthia up too. All right guys, I am at the girls' gymnastics and it looks like they are pulling up right now, coming to the car with Cynthia. Mom said they were so good at tumbling. Will you, Cynthia? You were so good. What should we do next, Cynthia? Okay. Uh huh. <gasps> that sounds awesome. Girls, Cynthia wants to jump on our tramp. Yeah! Let's go. It's too weird, though, guys. Hey, Steven, guess what? Cynthia's control our day, and she wants to jump on the trampoline. Um. Let's to go jumping! What, Cynthia? You want me to play a, you a special song on the piano? Suggestions? Pick mine, pick mine, pick mine. Oh, that's bad luck. Pick mine, pick mine, pick mine. I get you a luck, Peyton. Cynthia wants a dance party. Yes! Guys, this isn't good. I think the doll is taking Taylor somewhere. We've got to go and follow and see what's going on. Guys, this is one of the weirdest things I've ever seen. Taylor is over here walking down the sidewalk with Cynthia. Do you see her? Yeah. Taylor! Come on, Taylor, get in the car. We're gonna have to just keep following her. I'm super worried about what's going on. It's kind of creepy. Yeah. Holy moly, she's walking pretty quick too. Taylor? Guys, this is one of the weirdest things. Taylor's just walking down the street with the doll, and I'm starting to wonder if it's because of that. I'm wondering if the full moon is helping Cynthia control Taylor. We've gotta follow her around and make sure she doesn't do anything crazy. I'm getting really nervous about this. Guys, where do you think Cynthia's taking her? Um, Taylor. Taylor! Taylor! Huh? What are you doing? Get in the car. Taylor, why are you walking all over town? I, I just don't know why. All I could see was pumpkins. She wants to go somewhere with 
A lot of pumpkins. Somewhere with a lot of pumpkins? Do you know somewhere with a lot of pumpkins? The mm. pumpkin walk! What, Jordan? The pumpkin walk! Oh my gosh, I totally forgot about it. Right down the street there's a place where there's tons of pumpkins and people were just going and looking at them. Taylor, Taylor, do you think that's where Cynthia wants us to go? Yep. Alright, well let's go to the pumpkin walk and see what the heck is going on. See that? There's a bunch of pumpkins here. Jordan's right, there are tons of pumpkins here. But why would Cynthia or the doll maker want us to be here? I know she wants us here, Dad. I know it. All right, let's go check it out and see what the doll maker wants us to find here. <laughs> These are all the pumpkins I saw when I was walking with Cynthia. I just still don't understand why we're here. Guys, let's just keep going. I'm sure we can find something. I don't know why the doll maker sent us here, but I love this pumpkin. Skeletons are the best. Okay, we have been following Cynthia around all day. There's a full moon, and the pumpkins are all here. What, girls, what, what's wrong? It's a gremlin. What? It's a gremlin. Oh my gosh, guys, I thought something crazy was going on with the doll maker. They got me all nervous, and they just wanted to show off this cool pumpkin. My kids love gremlins. Make pies out of them. Enjoy your dessert. Have these crazy stories. Does that scare you at all, girls? No. I can't see. That's how it says. He's not saying Taylor? Dad! Taylor! Taylor, where are you going? Taylor! Again? Yeah. Taylor? Guys, I think it's happening again. Taylor, what did you bring us to? Have you ever seen this before? No. I think these things are telling a story. We better listen and see what's going on. It lays in ruin, run down and overgrown. But to all of us go see. Taylor. Taylor? Dad? What? We need to go to a haunted house. Is that what you were. How do you know that, Taylor? That's what Cynthia told me. Guys, this is super creepy. I don't know what's going on with Taylor, but apparently we have to go to some kind of crazy haunted house. I don't know if there's one around here. Dad. What? I know where a haunted house is. Where? Follow me. I have no idea where Peyton is taking us. I hope she knows something I don't know. Dad, this is it. What is it? This is where we need to go. Why? Where are we? At the hot chocolate shop. Oh my gosh, Peyton, I thought you were taking us somewhere serious. But hot chocolate does sound good. <sighs> now I'm ready to look for the doll maker again. Cynthia is wearing me down. I need a refresh. All right guys, I have to admit the hot chocolate is a good refreshment and break, but we need to do what Cynthia's telling us to do. Where in the world is there a haunted house? Do you think it's a haunted house like where people want to scare us? Or there's a place where there's real ghosts. Or is it like a bandit place? Not again. All right, well, I guess we gotta follow Taylor again. Taylor? Cynthia. Taylor. Stephen, what is going on with her? I don't know. She's done this so many times, but this time she's going all in. She can't won't even stop. Where do you think she's going, Jordan? To the haunted house. You think she knows where it's at? Yeah. yeah. Well, maybe she didn't know, but maybe Cynthia's. Taylor, her. come on, snap out of it. Snap, 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 snap. Taylor. Taylor, seriously, Taylor, snap Taylor. out of it. Dad, I know where we need to go. Where, where are we going? Okay, so she's out of her trance. We better just go where Taylor tells us to go. Hopefully we're gonna find the doll maker or figure out what's going on. All right, Taylor says she knows where we need to go. Is that right, Taylor? Yes. You got Cynthia? Let's go to the haunted house! You wanna go to the haunted house? Yeah. Is that where we're going? I think that's where Taylor said we're going. Is that where we're going, Taylor? Yes. All right, guys. 
let's go see what this haunted house is all about. I'm getting a little bit tired of the doll maker being in charge of us today. Dad, tonight, turn into that parking lot with Dale. All right, Taylor says we're here, and I think she might be right. Take a look at this place. That's not a haunted house or a haunted cabin, then I don't know what is. Does the doll maker live in there? Hmm. I don't like it one bit. It's old, it's creepy, and it's been one of those nights. I'm not sure if this is something we should do. Guys, who thinks we should go and check out what's going on here? Me. No, me. Taylor, what do you think? Dad, we have to. Guys, I think I'm with Taylor here. We've got to check this place out. Yeah. Hopefully nothing too creepy happens. All right, we are out here in front of this creepy haunted looking cabin, but I'm not sure how we're gonna get in. It's locked from the outside, Taylor. If it's, it's locked up there too. Are you gonna open it? Are you seriously gonna open it? Taylor, if it's locked from the outside, that means somebody doesn't want whatever's in here to get out. What do you think we should do? Do you think the doll maker's trapped in there? What if the doll maker is trapped in this building and the reason we got sent the dolls is because he's trying to escape? I don't like this at all, Dad. Where's the key? Yeah, we don't have the key. I don't know how we'd even get in here. Guys, I think we should explore this little haunted cabin and see what's going on. Look, there's a boarded up window up there. Should uh, we boost you up there? No, I'm not going up there. No, <laughs> heck no, no. I don't want to go up there either. No. This we is so weird. Look at this place, guys. Oh, another door. Come here. There's windows. Oh. Oh. There's windows and the door. We gotta be really quiet. I'm scared. I'm a little bit nervous about this too, but I think we need to check it out. It's locked from the outside. It's locked from the outside too. Why is the window speaking up? Did you see something? Yes. What? I was like, I don't know, it's, it was too fast. <sighs> okay, I have an idea, and I don't know if everybody's gonna like it, but I think we should just put Cynthia on the step and get out of here. What do you guys think? Yeah. yeah. No. Taylor, Cynthia's taking you over like three times today. I can't. She's been bossing us around. <clears throat> What's that noise? No. Let's go. Go, go. <laughs> Okay, we're back in our car. That was so scary. Oh my gosh, what was that thing? I dropped Cynthia. Wait. Where is she? She's on the step, I think. You dropped her over, like over by the front? I think. Oh no. Let's go get her. Guys, I think we need to take a vote. Once and for all, we need to decide because I think we should just go. If this is the doll maker's house, maybe this is where Cynthia wants to be. Yeah. Steven. Steven, what do you think? I, I say we leave her here because all she's done is cause trouble. Taylor, what do you think we should do? She's my best friend. She can't go. Parker, what do you think we should do? Leave her? No. So we have two votes left. I hope we don't have a tie. Payton, do you think we should leave Cynthia or take Cynthia? Take Cynthia. Jordan's. Leave. Guys, I think Cynthia's made her choice for us. Guys. Say bye to Cynthia. Hi, Sony family. Hi, Sony family. Hey, guys. We are in beautiful Arizona. Um, the kids flew on an airplane for the first time here. We're here to visit some family members and to go to a football game. Right now, everyone is playing some golf in the backyard, and then we're going to be heading out to have some awesome fun here in Arizona. Yay! Let's have football. How are you feeling today, Taylor? Better. Better. She's not doing so well. She's a little sad about Cynthia, and she's been kind of acting a little off, but she's feeling a little bit better. We kind of just are kind of glad that Cynthia is gone and that she is away, and creepy things aren't happening anymore in our family, so we're ready to have some fun. I have to make this shot to tie Dad. Oh, too far. Round one. Dad wins. I like to watch them play from the shade because it is hot out there. Weather in Arizona is a lot different than Utah, where we came from. Parker, 
Parker, we need to stop singing that song. It's creepy. They're not singing that song. We're having a hard time getting rid of Cynthia. Even though she's not in our family anymore, we're having a hard time getting rid of her. Parker sings that song all the time. Let's go explore Arizona. You guys ready? Yeah. Are you gonna get lost? Hopefully not. Yeah, we're gonna get lost. Who wants to go see where dad was born? Steve is from Arizona, so I guess we're gonna go check out. My old house. His old house, old stomping ground. Old abandoned house. Let's do it. The back door. It's not abandoned. This has been going on for a while. Parker is tickling Blake. <laughs> Are they having too much fun in this car? Yeah, too much fun. Too much fun, stop it. We're getting close to the street where Dad lived on. And here is a park where Dad used to play at when he was little, some baseball. There's his old house. Who thinks that dad should go out and dance in the driveway real quick of this random person's house? Dad, can I go? I do! Dad, Everyone go? vote! Who thinks that dad should go dance in the Daddy. driveway? Daddy. I think he has to go now. Do I get a vote? Yeah, no! Alright, looks like you're dancing in the driveway. Fine. <laughs> oh, guys, he's totally gonna dance in the driveway. So earlier someone mentioned, are we going to get lost on our adventure? What are we, Dad? We're lost. We're lost, guys. And we're, we're totally lost. And we're still lost. GPS got us lost! We're lost! We lost! All right, guys, I think we found out where we're going. We're stopping for potty breaks. And look, she fell asleep. She's so tired. Jordan's asleep back there too. We had a late night last night. We've arrived at the fun. Release the kids. Woo, let's go. Um, that was awesome. We are here at a place called Dave and Buster's. Supposedly it's really good food and there's some fun games for the kids to play there. So we are meeting family and friends there to eat and have a good old time. Can't wait. <laughs> Parker wants gummy worms in her drink.
You know dinner is over when this happens at a restaurant. Dinner's done, now it's time to play! 100 points! delicious the arcades games are fun all the kids won some prizes oh my gosh scared me to death <laughs> all right everybody let's get in the car how comfortable this seat is All right guys, we had a blast today. We have arrived back at the place that we are staying here in Arizona. We're gonna get inside and end our vlog. Uh. Cynthia's in my bed? Uh, I thought we left her at the cabin. Oh no, no, no. This is crazy. I don't like how she keep on appealing places. How did she end up here in Arizona, guys? Did she fly on the airplane with us? Has she been following us around all day long without us knowing? Comment below if you've been seeing Cynthia all day. We cannot get rid of this doll. She's everywhere. She's everywhere. No! <laughs> hey, Sodi family. We are just sitting here on my bed, me. Parker, Cynthia, and Dad. We have been researching all day long. Um, we are trying to figure out the best solution for the Cynthia problem, and we came across some kind of scary information. Yeah, Cynthia's creeping me out. And we've been studying the three other channels that got a doll sent to them, and we found something kind of similar between theirs and what's going on with our family. So the doll maker has sent out four dolls to different YouTube families and um, we have discovered that the doll is gravitating and attaching to one family member in each one of these families. And apparently if we don't get rid of this doll by midnight tonight, one of us might turn into a doll. We've tried to get rid of the doll before, but she just keeps coming back. I don't know what the solution is, and I'm kind of worried for Taylor because that's who the doll, our doll, Cynthia, seems to be attached to. Good luck, Taylor, and she's freaky. I don't think this is something that Steve and I can solve on our own, so I think we need to involve our entire family to figure out what the best way to get rid of Cynthia is. Let's do it. Let's do it. Guys? 
We need your help. With what? We learned that we have to get rid of Cynthia by midnight tonight or one of us is gonna turn into a doll. We can't get rid of Cynthia. Taylor, if I were you, I'd be worried. She's been kind of connecting to you. That's a little weird. I wouldn't mind becoming a doll. Say what? All right, what are you guys' ideas for getting rid of Cynthia? How are we going to do? Maybe we try, try and get her to get her attached to someone else. No. But I like her with us. Let's play with her. La, 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 The faster we get rid of Cynthia, the better. La, 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 Parker, you should stop. La, la, Taylor, la, stop. La, Taylor, la, Taylor. La, Taylor. La, gotcha. I can't Not you. funny. Maybe we should take her to a toy store and leave her there. Cynthia's looking at me and I don't like it. I don't want any part of this. Good luck, guys. I'll be hanging out with Uncle Derek. What a wimp. Guys, I don't think anything's gonna happen. I think she should stay with us. I don't care. I'm not waiting until midnight. I'm getting rid of her. <gasps> no! All right, so I'm gonna get you guys updated on what's happening. We ended up at this park right here. Um, Jordan really wanted to come to this park. She has an idea of the best way to get rid of Cynthia. So they're out there trying to figure it out and we'll go check out what she decided. Hopefully it works. All right, guys, where are you? Where did you decide to put Cynthia? I know exactly where to leave her. Hopefully you're not afraid of heights, Cynthia. Bye, Cynthia. I hope you don't come back. I think that's gonna work, guys. Guys, you can't leave Cynthia up there all alone. We gotta go, Taylor. We gotta go. No, no, Cynthia. All right, guys, a storm is coming. It is starting to rain. We need to get in the car. We left Cynthia, and hopefully it worked. Guys, it's like six o'clock. It's getting close to midnight. I hope Cynthia finds someone else to get attached to. No, 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 don't do that, Cynthia. All right, guys, we're gonna try and lighten the mood a little bit. We're gonna go on a daddy-mommy-daughter date since Steven is at home with Uncle Derek. He was a little too scared of Cynthia. So we're gonna go have some fun and try and lighten the mood. Taylor's a little upset, but let's go have fun, guys, okay? Let's get rid of Cynthia once and for all. We're gonna go to an awesome place in Heber City called the Old Goat. My friend just opened it up today. Yeah, so it'll be our first time ever going to a restaurant on opening night. It's gonna be awesome. Steve, stop! Is that Cynthia right there in the middle of the road? Oh my gosh, this doll will not go away. Guys, we have to go get her because she, one of us might turn into a doll. Steve, go get her. We need to figure out a different way. Obviously that didn't work, Jordan. Um, she's getting all wet. She followed us. This is crazy. I don't want Taylor to turn into a doll. We don't want to turn into a doll. All right guys, we are pulling up to the old goat right now. We decided that we're not gonna let the doll maker ruin our dinner and our evening. So we're gonna go to dinner at um, this restaurant and I guess bring Cynthia and then we're gonna spend the next few hours before midnight hits trying to get rid of her so that one of us doesn't turn into a doll. We totally should leave her at the restaurant. All right, we're pulling up now. I really do think that we'll bring Cynthia in with us and then maybe we can find another family that will take her. I don't like this idea at all. I am super excited about this. This is my first time going to the grand opening of a restaurant. Who's excited to eat here? I am. It's gonna be Cynthia's last meal with us. <laughs> all right guys, we are at the restaurant sitting down and so is Cynthia. I don't want her to know what's going on. Taylor's taking care of Cynthia. Hopefully she won't be too upset either. She's following. Did you take Cynthia? Parker found something that she definitely wants on the menu. What are you gonna get? A peanut butter sandwich. 
They have peanut butter and jelly. <laughs> well, it started raining, so they brought us back inside. And guess who I get to sit next to? Yay. All right, so it looks like dinner is just about done. Everyone cleaned off their plates pretty good, except for Parker. She didn't even want her peanut butter and jelly sandwich. We'll have to go home and make her a peanut butter and jelly sandwich at home. Are you guys all ready to leave Cynthia behind? <coughs> Gotta do what Blake says. It looks like there's a few people and maybe some kids left in this restaurant, so I think we're gonna sneak out of here and leave Cynthia. Bye, Cynthia. <laughs> There's another family there. Hopefully that she wants them and that they'll go with her. It's, she's just not working out in our family at all. All right, well now that Cynthia's taken care of and dinner's done, we've got a couple errands to run, so we're gonna run to the store real quick. Mom. Then we're heading home and going to bed. But guys, it is raining outside. Winter is coming quick. It is cold and raining. Thank goodness we packed all of the kids' jackets. In the back, we're gonna get jackets on, head into the store, do some shopping, and go home. All right, get your guys' coats here. What are we doing? Girls? What? <gasps> Cynthia? I thought we left her in the car. I thought we left her in the restaurant. Yes, she's back. Oh, oh, in the oh. Pull on the way to I thought we got rid of her. Okay. Shoot, well, I guess Cynthia's going shopping with us. All right guys, we only have three hours left before midnight. I'm getting a little nervous. Taylor doesn't seem like she's nervous at all, but I'm worried for her. All right, so we're in the toy section because we need to look for a birthday present for a friend. So we're on the hunt for a birthday present for a little girl. And Parker wants all of the toys for herself. and maybe someone else will buy her. Then, none of us will turn into a doll. Best idea ever. Guys, let's hurry and get out of this store before anyone notices. Now! All right, did everyone get inside? Yeah. Okay, is everyone buckled? Yeah. Okay, let's get out of here. I think we did Cynthia for good now. I think she'll be perfectly happy where we left her. Hopefully happy enough to stay there forever. All right guys, we have arrived back home. Steven and Derek are inside. We're gonna get the girls out of the car. Every single person is asleep in this car. Except for Blake, guys. She's wide awake. Blake, why aren't you sleeping? <laughs> All right guys, so all of the girls are in bed. Steven and Derek are still being loud and crazy downstairs, but it is just about midnight. We successfully got rid of Cynthia, finally. Everything is good, they're sleeping. I'm just gonna check on them real, real quick to make sure that everything's great and then I'm gonna go to bed. Jordan.
Good night, Peyton. And Taylor, good. Taylor? Where's Taylor? Steve, it's midnight and Taylor's gone. What do you mean she's gone? She's not in her bed. Are you serious? Taylor? Taylor? I don't know where the heck she can be. Taylor? Taylor? It's just a toy, Taylor, that they don't move. No, she's real alive. She's part of our family. She's just a doll. She's not just a doll. I love her. Mm -mm. You think she's part of our family, but she's not. Where are you? Guys, this is one of the weirdest things I've ever seen. Taylor is over here walking down the sidewalk with Cynthia. Do you see her? Yeah. Taylor! Guys, say bye to Cynthia. What are you doing out here?